Hi, this is Neil Walters with another quick tech tip on GoDaddy. In the last video, I taught you how to forward a subdomain to your own URL, oftentimes an affiliate link. And this time, I want to show you the difference between forwarding and forwarding with masking. So once again, I'm in GoDaddy here. I want to look for my website, We Learn and Earn. And I open it up. And hopefully, you saw that prior video, but if you didn't, we learned about setting up forwarding down here where you can have your main domain go to one URL and then you can have up to about 90 subdomains going to different URLs. So I'm going to click manage on my subdomains and yesterday in the video I set up one called demo and now I want to modify that so I'm going to click the edit button right here and the thing I want to show you the difference is, is between forward only and forward with masking. So I do that. The title here, let's see you hover over that little eye, it says enter a short title that describes your web page. This displays at the top of the browser. So let's just call it free traffic videos. Actually, there's some other things you could put in here, but I think we don't need to do that. So now I'm just going to click edit. And now that's been saved. I have to save button. Sorry, now it's saved. And it says it may take a few moments to take effect. So I'm going to pause the video and come back when that has uh, propagated. So now I've waited about 20-30 uh, minutes and I'm going to try my URL now. So I can come up to the top here in the browser and type in free, and see I've already done it before, free traffic videos dot we learn and earn dot com. And press enter. And you can see the site loads. And right now it's a squeeze page asking me to enter my email. This is the first time I've been here. And you can see, again, the URL here is the one I wanted. It did not get changed to that kind of goofy-looking affiliate URL. And the other interesting thing is at the top here, it says free traffic videos from Neil Walters. I actually went back into GoDaddy later and put the from Neil Walters on there just to show you that you can actually put the words you want in the title bar up here. I'm not sure a lot of people actually notice that, but it's kind of interesting that you can do that all from within GoDaddy. So what you learn here is that you can use a subdomain like this on your URL and you can forward it to an affiliate link and you can actually keep your URL in the browser here and people don't even really know then that it's not your site and not your affiliate link. That's how that works. Um, Sneil Walters, uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.